Millions of them provide the fungus with its food, and in return, the fungus cultivates tiny mushrooms as food for the ants. The fungus releases chemical signals that tell the worker ants what type of leaf it wants to eat. Scouts are sent out with the latest orders. Today's crop is being taken from a young bixa tree. Between them, the ants can demolish a large leaf in a matter of minutes. Now the pieces are carried back to the underground fungus. The ants can run at speeds of two meters a minute. Thousands of pieces are delivered every hour to the waiting fungus. Fed by such a continuous supply, the fungus grows rapidly. It seems that the fungus has the upper hand. But it fights back. The Bixa tree floods its leaves with toxins that could kill the distant fungus. As the ants carry the fragments back, they are themselves poisoning the fungus on the tree's behalf. As the poison takes effect, the ants sense that their fungus is weakening. And they respond to its signals by changing to another source of leaves. So the plant's chemical response forces the ants to constantly switch from tree to tree. Strike and counter-strike. And that ensures that enough leaves remain uneaten for each tree to recover. <laughs>